Hello and welcome, dear traders and investors. I'm glad to present you the daily market review prepared by analysts and experts from FX.co portal. Here we go. Today is December 18 and we're starting from your dollar pair with Dian Lao. The volume of long positions on EURUSD pair decreased around the resistance level of 1.10. As a result, the quote returned to the level 1.0900. On the 4-hour chart, the RSI indicator left the overbought territory. However, the RSI is still hovering in the upper area of 5070, which points to the bullish sentiment. On the same chart, the alligator movings average have slowed down the upward movement, but are still pointing upwards. Keeping the price above 1.0900 level could indicate an increase in the volume of long positions. In this case, the power could rise towards the 1.10 However, keeping the price below 0900 level during the day may lead to further downward movement, reversing the recent uptrend. The comprehensive indicator analysis in the short term and intraday periods suggests a bearish signal. Indicators also signal an uptrend in the medium term. We've got a trading plan for GBPUSD, the next major, Dimitris Tapas describes. Early in the European session, the British pound is trading around 1.2670, within a downtrend channel formed since December 15, and showing some exhaustion of bearish strength. The British pound is located below the 21 SMA. And above the 200 EMA. Both points could serve as a range zone to buy or sell. The uptrend could resume only if GBP USD trades above 1.2630. Then we could expect a move towards 1.2695, 88 mirror level, and the instrument could even reach the 1.2726 level. The H1 chart shows that the British pound opened with a bearish gap of around 1.2682. And is likely to rise and cover the gap in the coming hours. If a technical rebound continues from the current levels, the British pound could find strong resistance around 1.2695. If it reaches 1.2726, both levels could serve as an opportunity to resume selling. In case the British pound consolidates above 1.2726, it could resume the uptrend and GBP USD could reach plus 1.8 Murray at 1.2817 and could even reach the psychological level of 1.30. On the other hand, in case GBP USD falls below the 200 EMA at 1.2629, the outlook remains negative for the pound, and we could continue to sell with targets at 78 Murray at 1.2573 and up to the psychological level of 1.25. The eagle indicator is given a negative signal. So any bounce that approaches or trades below 1.28 
will be seen as an opportunity to sell. And finally, here's Laurie Bailey with AUDUSD currency pair forecast. Let's have a look. The Australian dollar has settled above the level of 0 0.6693. The Marlin oscillator has turned down, but is currently in a position to rise. The pair can reach the target level of 0 0.6775. The next target will be 0 0.6815. Achieving this level will also mean reaching the upper band of the price channel. If the price consolidates below 0 0.93, it may switch the main scenario to a downward alternative. The price will try to reach support at 0 0.6612, near the lower bound of the price channel. On the 4-hour chart, the price is consolidating above the support level of 0 0.6693. Both indicator lines are pointing upward. The Marlin oscillator has discharged from the overbought territory. Now it can continue to rise. That's all for today. See you online soon and good luck.